Hey, how's it going YouTube? So today I'm going to be doing a movie review on Tron Legacy. Tron Legacy is an American science fiction film directed by Joseph Kosinski and is produced by Steven Lisberger. Okay, it, I watched this movie tonight. It's the second time I've watched it and I thoroughly enjoyed it. I actually thought it was a pretty cool movie because it like incorporated Star Wars and The Matrix. You get all the Matrix moves in there. Like the guy spinning around as he's dodging the the lights, the light discs. I think that's what it's called. And yeah, they have a, like a Star Wars scene where they're busy fighting with their lightsabers, if you want to call it that. But yeah, it's a pretty cool movie. Um, Storyline goes that the father has a son and he's busy working on a new world inside this um, utopia area. Well, that's what the place is called. And he's... One day he just disappears and his son doesn't know why. The son grows up and finds himself in the world that his dad created, which is Utopia. And now his mission is to try and get out of this world. And there's only one way out and that's a portal. But it's only open because he came in. He gets reunited with his dad and it's pretty cool to, to figure out at that point where... The other characters come into play like um clue and tron and his dad so the one thing i loved about this movie has to be the ending where cora the iso that is found on this utopia gets to go for a ride on this guy's motorbike and sees the sun for the first time and how she's so amazed at what the world is like because all that she's known is darkness and laser lights and all that jazz. So this is so that has to be one of the the high points as well as the light cycle race where they're busy rushing around everywhere and just destroying each other with their light beams on the ends of their cycles. If I have to think about something that I didn't like about the film, it's what could it be? Um Probably the way that the programs or the people in Utopia, when, when they die, they shatter into glass. Now that's weird, it's supposed to be shattering into data or anything, but it just, it doesn't look realistic. Um, and the fact that Cora, when she gets hit at one point, she only loses her, her arm, whereas if any of the other characters had to get hit, they would lose, they would die completely. Um, it was a bit unrealistic and yeah so overall I would give this movie a 7 or no a 6 out of 10 just due to the the inconsistency when killing each other or the inconsistency in the deaths of the programs and the non-realism in that even though it's supposed to be in a pro in a different world it's just it looks weird but yeah otherwise it was a good movie and i hope you like this review um subscribe to my channel i'm going to be doing a lot more movie reviews from now on um as well as the, as the vlogs every now and then um but yeah hope you have an awesome day and see you next time cheers